Uh, Mr. Samples, I understand you caught a big bass on Lake Lanier. Well, he was a pretty good size. Didn't he? How big was he? 22 pounds and 9 ounces. 22 pounds and 9 ounces. Well, the world's record, of course, is 22 pounds and 4 ounces. I believe you'd have one five five ounces over that. Well, uh, I thought he's 25 pounds something. I mean, I took the fish home, brought him home, and cleaned him, need him. I didn't, I didn't know that. Uh, well, I never thought about being nothing like that. I mean, I didn't think I had no record. I know that I had a record, but I didn't think I did on the fish. Did you measure him? Yeah, 32 inches long. Where'd you weigh him at? Well, I don't know. I was drunk. We weighed him summers, and they didn't nobody dispute the word. For they, everybody asked how much he weighed, and I'd just tell them how much he weighed, and, and then, then nobody offered to weigh him again. I showed him all over the county. I reckon I did. I think I did. Many people saw the fish then. Uh, they, yeah, there's plenty of people see the fish. What'd you catch him on? A little bitty spring lizard. A little bitty white bellied spring lizard. What kind of tackle was you using? Using a Zebby Co. 33 with, I think, a 12 pound test line. It's 8 or 12, and I'm not sure which. But uh, he didn't put up much fight as a 2 pounder would. He just, after he come up and stood on that tail and chuck that head about three or four times, he just turned over on his side and just drug him right on in. He jumped? He jumped once then, you say? One time, yeah. That's all. Where, what area of the lake was you fishing in? I was fishing about a mile below Ball Ridge Marina. Out about the... a mile down the lake below Ball Ridge on the Smurred Island. Uh-huh, out in the big part of the lake, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, what, uh, what made you cast over there on that Smurred Island, anyway? Well, I dropped Anchor Rock there on the island, and I pitched my little outfit, that little 33 out, and I had some heavy equipment there in the boat, had a big 55, and uh, I was gonna put big lizard on them and get ready for big bass, and I just got one hooked, and I looked over there and seen my line stretching out, straightened out, you know, see it stretching out. I reached down and caught him. When I jerked him, I thinks I'm hung, for it didn't go nowhere when I jerked. Just that's about it. I mean, he come up there, stood on that tail, and that about wound it up. Well, uh, how come you uh, didn't take him up to the Marine and get him weighed right away? Well, I didn't, I didn't, didn't think nothing about it. I mean, I was fishing for something to eat. Do you know what the world's record bass was? No. You haven't had any ideas? I thought it's 25 pounds something or other. That's how come I didn't. I could have, I mean, if, if I'd known that that was it, well, I might have weighed him or something other, you know, somewhere. No, we did weigh him, but I don't know where. I thought weighed him down at Joe Hatcher, but Grace said, Harold said he didn't weigh him down there, so I don't guess we weighed him down there. Well, how did the fish eat? Good. How often did you have him? More than one meal? Three messes. Three messes. What, supper and breakfast? And... Supper, dinner, and breakfast. Supper, breakfast, and dinner. Put it like that. That's the way we eat him. Well, if you catch another big fish like that, weighs over 22 pounds, what are you going to do with it? I'm going to have my picture took every time I can get to a Kodak and frame him. I didn't know the, I didn't know how to record. Jenna, you, you like fish a lot, don't you? Well, I've let uh, work has hindered my fishing last two years. It never done it before then, but it has for the last two years. But it ain't going to hinder it so much from now on, for I'm going to do a bunch of fishing. Uh, what's the biggest bass you caught before this? Uh, I'm not certain. I think 12 pound, 4 ounces. You do a lot of hunting? Yeah. You do any good? Mm, I got me a 12-point buck last year. That was down at Cedar Creek? Mm-mm. Got him at Greensburg. 
Uh, on the Putwood land. What kind of business you in, Mr. Sam? Cartoning, driving nails. You'd rather be fishing? Lot rather. <laughs>